this video we will hear about why we blow conch or shankha. When a conch or shankha is blown, the primal sound of Om emerges. Om is the sound that was emanated by God before creation of the universe. The conch or shankha is one of the attributes of Lord Vishnu. It is said that once a demon named Shankasura harassed the demigods and stole the Vedas and hid himself in an ocean. Lord Vishnu incarnated as a huge golden fish that is Matsya Avtar and killed the demon. After this, the Lord was supposed to have blown the conch-shaped bone of the ear of Shankasura. From this arose the sound Om and from this sound emerged the Vedas. The conch is therefore known as Shankha after Shankasura. The conch of Lord Vishnu or Lord Krishna is called the Panchaganya. It represents dharma or righteousness which is one of the four objectives of human life. The sound of conch also symbolizes the victory of good over the evil. During the ancient times, conches would also be used before the start of a battle. There are few verses in the first chapter of Bhagavad Gita which describes the conches of Lord Krishna and the Pandavas on the battlefield of Kurukshetra. Conches also had been blown during artis and important festivals in temples to serve as the reminder to those villagers or citizens who have missed the worship. The sound of the conch helps people to make their minds concentrate on God while praying and drive away other stray thoughts. The conch is placed in temple and even in domestic shrines as a symbol of Nada Brahma or the sound of Om, the Vedas, Dharma, victory or auspiciousness. It is also at times used to give Tirtha water that is holy water to devotees on the temple. Because of its close association with Lord Vishnu, the blowing of the conch is an essential part of Vaishnavite rituals practices. It is believed the blowing Shanka destroys enemies and also pleases goddesses Lakshmi. Not just for religion, blowing Shanka has scientific and Ayurvedic benefits also. As per them, blowing Shanka during puja has benefits on our lungs. This is because for blowing a Shanka, Pure air reaches the lungs and the impure air comes out. This means the lungs become strong. And blowing shanka also cures diseases of intestine. Thank you very much.